to YouTube. I'm finna be teaching y'all how to cut your own hair. I'm finna be showing y'all how I cut my hair. So, yeah, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. I just got a retwist. And I'm finna just cut my own hair, get myself right. So, I'm gonna be showing y'all. All right, first you want to do is um comb your hair down. You want to do that before you start fading. Comb your hair down, get all the nuts up, and I'll be back with my next step. All right, I got my one and a half guard. One and a half guard. And I'm finna just debulk before I start fading. I'm just going down, and I'll be back when I'm done with that. All right, right now you want to get your trimmer or your clipper. And I'm going to be setting my ball guideline. Right now I'm going not too far above my ear. And you want to make sure you set this guideline nice and neat. Right now I got a soft trimmer. If you're using a trimmer, make sure you don't have a hard trimmer. Especially if you're a beginner, it'll be, um, it'll be hard to get that line out. So basically what I'm doing, what I do to one side, I do to the other side. You want to make this guideline as neat as possible. And don't talk about me the way I use my mirror. I know I use my mirror different than the way everybody else do, but it's the only way, it's how I do it, you feel me? And I'll be back with the next step. You wanna make sure everything is bobbed before you go to your next step. So right now I'm just getting everything bobbed, taking my time, you feel me? Ain't no need to rush. What I do to one side, I'm doing to the other side. Now y'all been y'all been saying y'all been wanting to um want this video, so make sure y'all hit that like button, subscribe, and comment if y'all want me to do more haircut videos. You feel me? I go to the shop and record them, y'all. But yeah, make sure y'all get everything bought. All right, right now I got my one guard, and the lever is completely open. And I'm finna comb my hair down. I'm probably finna go up a whole inch. You want to debulk? Always debulk before you fade. It'll make your fade come out smoother and easier. Always debulk. So right now I'm just debulking. You feel me? Setting up for that kill shot. And if you haven't hit that like button, and what I do to one side, I do to the other side. So I'm just gonna let y'all work. Uh, I. I don't, I down fade and up fade. I'm just gonna let y'all see what I do. And I'm just, you feel me right now? Just going up. And I'll be back when next step. This sound like Quill. All right, right now I got my fade masters with the lever open and I'm finna go up half of what I said. Like, you see how I'm going halfway and I'm like flicking out. This is where you want to pay attention to. This guideline right here determines your whole fade. You want to make sure this is smooth, clean, as possible. Like, so this, I, I went up like a inch. Now I'm just going up half an inch with my liver open right now. I'm making sure everything's laid down. You see me brushing and uh, fading. Mm -hmm. And I'll be back with my next step. Right now, I got my one and a half guard, and I got it closed, and I'm finna go up. Uh, this is probably gonna be the highest guard I use in this fade. Usually, I go lever open with the one and a half, but for some, for some reason, I already had it closed. I don't know why, but yeah, basically, that's what I'm going up to. And later on in this fade, I'm gonna go clear out the um, bulk at the top by my dreads, because I don't wanna fade in my dreads, so yeah. Just get that and close. I really, I like a real light fade. So, yeah. Right now I got my one guard 
Then I'm finna attack that line, that middle line y'all see. You wanna start below the line, flick up to the line. This, learning how to take out a line, that's gonna be one of the major steps into learning how to fade. Like, just go to the line. You wanna make sure you hit the line. When I first started fading, I used to be scared to hit line. Make sure you hit the line and flick out. I really don't do too much of a flick out motion, you feel me? But yeah, I'll be back in the next up. You see right here, I got my one guard. I can't really tell if it's open. I probably got it open, but later on in the video, I'm in the closing. You see, I'm kind of getting knocking that bolt down at the top since I don't want to fade up to my dread, so I got to go with the grain. So, yeah. All right, right now I'm finna guard. I'm finna grab my point five guard, and I'm finna go down all. These notches, so I'm gonna go first notch, second notch, third notch, fourth notch, then get fully closed. Right now, I got the lever open. I'm gonna keep notching, using them notches. Uh, this is a bad angle, by the way. But, yeah, I'm just going, starting below the line, going up to the line, then flick, flick out. You see right here, I'm closing the lever one notch, and I'm going right back at it. I'm trying to flick at that line. And right now, I closed it again because I felt like it wasn't doing nothing. Sometimes I go halfway fully closed, but for um for this video, I had used all my notches. So yeah, just this keep picking like that well. up. All right, I close the notch up again. You know, flick it up the line. I'm using more of my corners. Cause you wanna use some corners. You wanna use some corners to detail and get certain little hairs. And, and yeah, make sure you use your corners to detail your face. All right, now I'm just going all the way around the head with my point five guard, trying to get that line out from our uh, liver open. So, yeah, uh, this is the only way I can use the mirror. Like, usually I be seeing people like turned around with the mirror in front of their face and they back towards the mirror, but I can't do it that way, bro. So I just do it like this. You can see this fade is getting there. It's starting to get, it's starting to look faded. We just gotta uh, fade in the top and take out the bottom line and we good. All right now I grab my two guard on my babblis and I'm going up. Uh, it's, it really ain't end up doing nothing. But, Y'all can just watch me do that. Is that, Is that it did a little song, a little song, song, song. And that right there, I really can't see. Like, I'm gonna have to use my mirror to get that. But yeah. I see me get my own one and a half guard, cause that two guard went on my neck. All right, now I'm going with the guard with that. Oh, now I'm going against it. Boom, boom, boom. At the end, this is all going to be faded. So I'm just hitting that line at the top, blending that in. I got my one and a half guard closed. I'm hitting that line at the top, right there.
all right this is the last step well not really but i'm trying to take out that bar line y'all see me the back fade is basically there you feel me and what i do is go open halfway close with this right now i got it open just softening up that line flicking out that you see i'm flicking out on this step i do more of a flick out motion and with these masters like you can hear if you hit a hair cutting that means you hit that line right make sure you flick out right now i went halfway what am i doing boy now i'm gonna have way flicking at that line flicking at that line softening it up even more trying to get that line up it's gonna take you a little minute to get used to taking lines up but it's all practice practice and consistency you gonna mess up you gonna mess up your hair a couple of times you feel me i first cut my hair when i didn't know nothing about barber and like none of that and yeah i was messing my chunk up but i had a dread so nobody can really tell but yeah but just keep notching at that line keep hitting that line keep hitting that line use all your notches if you have to and it should come out Right now I'm prepping the hairline. I'm going, I'm going down with a one and a half. Then later on, I realized that one and a half really not doing it justice, sir. So I'm gonna grab my one. All right, I'm grabbing my spritz, my got to be, and I'm just spraying at my hairline. Then I'm gonna uh, let it dry, and I'm brushing the hairs for getting lock in for when I come with my trimmers. I can just hit it easy and do the lineup. Uh, I got hair on the back of my neck and stuff. I'm going to go back later on and clean that up. Alright, YouTube. This is the before. You see, I needed a haircut real bad. And this is the after. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And we out. Comment if you want more barber videos. You want more gaming videos. Anything, I'm going to drop it. Make sure y'all like, comment, subscribe. And we out.